In this video, we'll practice comparing fractions using models or pictures. Imagine you've been given an assignment to create a project with a classmate using a single poster board. You decide to divide the poster board in half so each of you can work on your project. You each get half the poster board. Then the teacher adds another pair of students to your project. Now each of you will get one-fourth of the poster board. Let's draw a rectangle to show the fraction one-half. It is divided into two equal parts, or halves. One of the parts is shaded. Let's compare one-half to one-fourth. This rectangle is the same size. It is divided into four equal parts, or fourths. One of the parts is shaded. We can see that one half is a bigger piece than one fourth. So, one half is greater than one fourth. We also see that one fourth is less than one half. Let's compare two fractions that are equivalent or have the same value. This circle shows a hole. The circle is divided into four equal parts. Two of the parts are shaded. The circle shows the fraction two-fourths. The second circle is the same size as the first. The second circle is divided into eighths. Four of its parts are shaded. This circle shows the fraction four-eighths. Two-fourths is equal to four-eighths. Equivalent fractions have different numerators and denominators, but the size of the fraction is still the same. Good job comparing fractions!